Y'all, this is Derek Lamont Simmons, 50 years old. Now, he worked at the Intel facility in Chandler, Arizona, that plant. And he unalived this coworker and injured the other one in the cafeteria. This was Saturday, February the 18th at like six o'clock in the morning. He started off with a baseball bat, then used a hatchet and a knife. And when the other coworker tried to intervene, which I don't know why they did, he swung on them. Oh. <sighs> year old Derek Lamont Simmons facing first degree murder and aggravated assault charges after allegedly killing one person and hurting another inside the Intel Ocotillo campus on Dobson and Ocotillo roads. Chandler police receiving multiple calls about a man with a hatchet inside the cafeteria just after six Saturday morning. When we arrived, one of the individuals was deceased. Another one was gravely injured um, and the third subject was uh, the individual who uh, committed this crime. According to court documents, police say Simmons allegedly killed one victim with a baseball bat, a hatchet, and a knife. Witnesses telling police Simmons struck the first victim in the head multiple times with a baseball bat. Then the second victim seated at the same table stood up to confront the suspect. That's when Simmons is said to have hit them in the back of the head with a bat. However, the redacted document does not include how the hatchet and knife came into play. Regarding the uh, weapons that were used, we're not going to disclose at this time. Documents also show Simmons was arrested in front of the building after turning himself in, telling police he was the one they were looking for. He was found carrying a duffel bag with the weapons used inside. Investigators still trying to figure out why Simmons allegedly did this, but according to the police report, it was a premeditated attack. Yeah, we do know that they were both employees here and they were co-workers. It was a violent situation, but it was an isolated incident. Now, we also did some digging into Simmons' criminal history, and we learned that he was arrested for aggravated assault with a deadly weapon back in 2001 in Texas. Intel also getting back to us tonight, telling us Chandler police are on site and working closely with Intel security during this investigation.